Hi there, this is Guy Fertman of Satori Prime, and I'm going to take you through a meditation practice. And you can do this meditation daily. It's about a 15 minute long practice, and we do recommend uh, starting any meditation, doing it daily for at least seven days, seeing how you feel, and then seeing if you want to continue from there. So to get started, if you can just find yourself a comfortable location, either a chair, a couch, somewhere you could sit on, and you can sit either cross-legged or with your legs flat on the ground. Uh, preferably you are not in your bed, as oftentimes when we're in our bed our body is ready for sleep. So if you're doing this meditation before sleep, feel free to do that, otherwise I recommend sitting in a chair or a couch. So we're going to be working with creating more free flow of energy in your body. So if you just gently close your eyes and just take a deep breath. And noticing that maybe that first breath felt a little bit restricted. So on this next breath, as you breathe in, just follow the breath down with your awareness wherever it goes, no need to effort. Just breathing in nice and deep and seeing how low it goes into the system. So breathing in. And out. And then another deep breath and seeing if it'll go lower in the system. breath and really letting go of the stomach muscles here and just letting it go as deep as it'll go into that belly. Another breath in and letting that breath go. Great. So what I want you to visualize is your spinal cord and right in front of your spinal cord are two meridian channels if you want to think of them like a roadway or a highway motorway that energy flows through it's about an inch in front of the spine and you're gonna have a flow of energy that moves from your crown all the way down the spine uh, to the perineum that's gonna be one flow and then from the ground up through the perineum the perineum is the area there between your uh, anus and genitalia so through the perineum up through the spine and out the crown of the head so what we're going to do is we're going to take a breath in pulling that breath from the ground through the perineum up the spine and through the open crown and on the out breath we are going to pull the energy from above the crown down through the spine and through the perineum and that's going to be going through two different meridian channels so one's going to go up and the other one's going to go down and we're not going to do this with a lot of by efforting we're just going to do it with our intention so breathing in from the ground through the perineum up the spine and out through the crown of the head and then breathing out allowing for the energy to come down through the crown down the spine, through the perineum, and into the ground. And then just effortlessly continuing this breath. So in and up. And then out and down. And then just continue that breathing at your own pace. to let go of any effort and focusing your intention on opening up and widening the meridian channels again without effort just using intention so that there's an easier more free-flowing energy 
moving through the body, a cosmic energy that can enter the body and actually resource the body, heal the body, creates more magnetism and charisma, and just allows for more alignment. So breathing in again through the perineum, up through the spinal cord and out the crown, and then breathing out. through the crown, down the spinal cord, and down through the perineum and back into the ground. And just keeping that breath going and even letting go of any structure around the breathing. Just freely breathing and then intending and watching that energy move up and down. You can even watch the energy move up and down at the same time as you breathe in and out. Just letting go of any structure here just allowing yourself to relax, to let go of effort, and to just breathe naturally, keeping the intention on the energy moving through the meridian channels. soft, loosening the jaw, relaxing any part of the body that might be holding tension still, relaxing the stomach and the back, the shoulders. back and just allowing for the head to be naturally held up, relaxing those hips, relaxing the thighs and the knees, the calves and the feet, the toes, the fingers, and continuing that breath up and down through the meridian channels. continues to move through your body, begin to imagine that there's a free flow of energy exiting the top of the head and also underneath your body. And this energy looks like a fountain that's shooting up and spilling over and then also shooting uh, down and spilling over. And now the fountain that's coming up from around and outside your head is obviously coming down your body and the same energy fountain that's pouring out of the bottom of you is actually coming up to meet the energy from the fountain that's on top. So slowly, again with intention and no effort, allowing from the energy that's spilling over from the top to begin slowly making its way to meeting the energy that's coming out of the bottom and it's actually spilling upwards to meet each other. Again, no rush here, just allowing for intention and in your own timing, feeling what's right for you, continuing the breath, noticing the meridian channels and just noting, noticing that spill over of energy and eventually allowing for the fountain from the top and the fountain from the bottom to meet like it's encapsulating you in a kind of energetic cocoon. And just allowing for effortless breath to bring you there. No need to rush. And also noticing any shifts in the body 
in your emotional state, mental state, energetic state as you go through this process. There's no right or wrong. Just important to notice whatever it is that you notice in today's practice. Continuing to effortlessly breathe and allowing for that energetic cocoon to form. And again, noticing any impact this has on the way that you feel or think or your emotional body, your mental body, spiritual body. And now with that cocoon formed around you, you're protected by this energy, you're encapsulated by this energy, resourced by this energy. With intention, continuing to hold the awareness of that energy, noticing the meridian channels, and then also bringing your awareness to your core. Just allowing yourself to effortlessly find your core, your awareness to find your core. And now with the breath, as you breathe in, you're gonna feel your core expanding out like you're filling up a balloon. In this case, an energetic balloon. And you're gonna begin to fill up this space, the space between you and the cocoon with yourself. So breathing in to the core and allowing it to expand out. And expanding to the point where you have filled the space and the edges of you have met the edges of the cocoon. So breathing in, expanding. Expanding. For that expansion to happen without effort and naturally taking its own time, its own syncopation, allowing yourself to fill up that space. space as well that we just created together. Letting the breath just move that through your body. And now taking those two hands, putting your right hand over your heart and your left hand right below that on your solar plexus and 
allowing for whatever came through, like an intention, allowing for that frequency, that energy, that information to enter the body space and actually permeate through the body, giving it new information, allowing for it to organize around this new energy and around this divine intention that came through today. And maybe you intuitively know what that is. Maybe it's just a sensation or something new that you feel today. Maybe it's a letting go. Maybe it's sadness. Maybe it's joy. So just permissioning whatever is here right now and allowing for that to be in its own perfect divine intelligent design. Trusting the body and the other ethereal energies that they just know. So taking another deep, deep breath, deepest one you've taken so far, and really letting that permeate through your body, through the meridians, and filling up that space. And as we begin to complete this meditation, to take this intention with you to bed or into your day and if you feel like it's appropriate and I invite you to to start keeping a daily journal where you write these intentions down and take about a minute to just fill in anything that you're grateful for this will create a lot of momentum in your life writing is energy where you invest your time and energy says a lot about where you're going in your life and life responds to energy. So if you want to create more momentum towards the things that are naturally coming through that you're intending, then I invite you to take that, like this practice right here, and make it part of your daily practice. So let's just do a quick bow with our heads and gratitude. Gratitude for today, gratitude for this life, gratitude towards yourself for taking this moment out of your day to restore, heal, and energize yourself to creating more alignment, to being present to a world that has nothing to do with achievement, a graciousness and love towards ourselves. for investing this time with me hope you enjoyed today's meditation and i'll see you again soon take care